Hi, I'm Larry Janeski from Dr. Energy Saver. This house is uh, an old cape that's been added onto. So now we're gonna inject uh, foam insulation into the walls to make the walls leak less and be more energy efficient. Let's take a look. Okay, we have our injection foam machine running here in the background, but when we took the siding off, we can see these gaps in the siding. And this was uh, something new was done to the house. It was remodeled, but here's old sheathing. And see these gaps here? Even this one, I could stick my finger in it these holes, this house leaks through there and this uh, vinyl siding is no match for air that wants to leak in or out. When we fill all these holes and seams and gaps with injection foam, it won't leak anymore. So if we take a look in these walls, uh, this house has been added onto over the years. Um, we see these walls are completely empty, have no insulation whatsoever. And you can see right in there, the first step of injecting foam insulation into walls is to remove the siding. And this is vinyl siding, so we, we remove it. If it was clapboard, we would drill the siding, wood clapboard, drill right through the siding and put wood plugs in there. Over here, we have uh, fiberglass insulation. And this is white fiberglass, as we can see. And you can see the different sheathings. The house has been modified over the years. And here we have the addition, which is newer. We see newer sheathing. We see pink fiberglass insulation. We have uh, plenty of air space in that wall cavity where that injection foam will go and uh, fill that wall cavity even more. Even though it has fiberglass bats, it's gonna take a lot of foam in that wall cavity to fill around that fiberglass bat, encapsulate it, infuse it with uh, foam, and really make sure there's no air spaces whatsoever to really tighten up the house from an air leakage perspective and make it have a better R value. Here we have a pretty common situation. It's uh, bay windows, could be bay windows or bow windows, and they have this sill that, that sticks out. And this is very cold and very leaky, the homeowner says. And the reason is, is that underneath is not uh, air sealed or insulated very well. Even on brand new houses, when you buy a bow or bay window from the lumber yard, and you're ready to install it, the bottom of it is just three quarter inch plywood. And the, it's up to the builder to uh, insulate the bottom of that, which hardly ever gets done. And so that window would be put in once the house is uh, sheathed with exterior plywood and the insulator comes along to do his job and he sees, well, let's insulate these walls. Okay, and he doesn't see out there as part of the inside of the house, it needs to be sealed. So what we're gonna do to fix this situation is we're gonna drill into the soffits underneath this bay window. And we have a space about that big that we can inject our foam into uh, now that we have the foam rig on site. And we can inject up in here and it'll fill all the cavities and insulate and air seal the sill of this bay window. Now, this is a Cape Cod and in a Cape Cod, Typically we have dormers and we have a sloped ceiling uh, upstairs. And we want to insulate that with injection foam. Uh, the homeowner said those closets are always cold. They're plaster ceiling inside. We're gonna inject the foam into those slope sections. We're actually gonna remove roof shingles, drill our two and a half inch holes in each bay and inject those slopes uh, with injection foam from the roof. We also have to inject the little walls of that dormer around. The roof is only one layer and it's only six years old. So we can get under there with a flat bar, loosen two courses of shingles up, pop out some nails, slide some shingles out, drill from the roof, and then put the shingles back when we're done. If you have any energy concerns in your home, call Dr. Energy Saver. We can help you make your home more comfortable. And that includes every room in your house should be comfortable in all seasons. We can help you have a healthier indoor environment and make your home more durable with less mold and allergens. Give Dr. Energy Saver a call.